Hey, how you guys doing out there? Welcome back to motherboards.org. You guys all know Ivy Bridge has now hit the market. Some people are gonna waste their time posting Sandy Bridge scores. We're not gonna do that right now. We're just gonna show you some of the great motherboards that have hit the market. One of the nicest motherboards I've actually seen so far is this new Z77 Sabertooth motherboard from the folks over at Asus. Now, the thermal armor and everything on this motherboard just looks absolutely incredible. I think you guys are gonna be really impressed with both the features and the elegance and just how overall this motherboard looks. It looks like it is combat ready. So let's jump on in and kick some ass and take a look at this thing. All right, folks, like all unboxings, we'll take a look at the front of the box. Then I'm gonna open up the box and have the camera just start up here and run down. So you guys can just see this real quick. We'll just run down this screen all the way down to here. We'll cover all this stuff more inside the review. This is just the unboxing. So let's just go ahead and let's pop the cap. You guys can see there's a nice clear window right here protecting the motherboard, but you can see it all through there. Go ahead and remove this thing right here. I like to show all the stuff that comes inside the box first. So let's go inside of here. Start off, we've got two of the SATA cables. Set those down. We have a fan inside of here. This is so you can create active cooling on the back of the motherboard. We'll get to that. But actually on the side of the motherboard with the rear I.O., there's a place to put this fan in and mount it for cooling. Pretty cool stuff. So that's the stuff in this bag. Various mounting hardware for doing your case mounting. When you put your case wires in, these are all very easy to use. You pop them on your motherboard and you can see them very easily connect. Got some more screws and some stuff inside of here for attaching the various components that go onto this, including the last little piece right for the fan right there for mounting that. We have the rear IO. We have a sticker. It says tough inside. Pretty cool stuff. I should wear that every day. Here's also the manual that shows you how to install all the various components that come in the Tough motherboard. That stuff that we showed you in the bag, how to install the fan and all that stuff, all inside of this. Make sure you read the proper documentation before you go doing anything so you don't make any mistakes. Stuff for memory and everything all in there. Here is your certificate of reliability. I think it's pretty cool. The motherboard comes with one of these, kind of like documentation that says, I kick ass. It's kind of cool. Have the motherboard manual. We also have the installation driver. Ah, it's well-designed, handwritten in Sabertooth. Actually, you guys, something I wanna let you guys know about Asus motherboards, all of these on launch, all of these motherboards are version 3.0. So other motherboards you're seeing on the market aren't going to be like this. These guys actually waited till the final rev of the motherboard to come out before they brought you the motherboard. So let me move this stuff out. get the motherboard out here and show it to you folks. This motherboard is very, very, very heavy. Now, before I jump into the features of the motherboard and stuff, I just want to show you guys a couple quick things that I talked about. The fan we spoke about earlier, it actually mounts right inside of here. Helps to keep your motherboard running much, much cooler. You guys can see the thermal guard all the way across the entire motherboard. Just real quick, show you guys the rear I.O. Now I'm gonna set the board down and let's talk about some of the features of the motherboard. Now the Sabertooth Z77 is known for their thermal armor. Their armor protection is one of the very exclusive features about this motherboard. It also features tough components. These components include ally choke, solid state capacitors, and MOSFETs that are built to withstand even the most demanding usage. These make for greater stability and longevity of the motherboard. They also have the thermal radar, which provide multiple sensors for measuring the temperatures on your motherboard, and then also tester server grade reliability. These include a series of hardcore tests, which include extreme temp and humidity trials for complete reliable motherboards that are ready for intense heavy duty usage. Now let's take a look at some of the hard specs for the motherboard. As far as the CPU goes, you guys know it's all ready for Intel's next generation Ivy Bridge processors on the LGA 1155 package. 
The chipset is the Intel Z77 Express chipset. As far as the expansion slots go, you get two PCI Express 3.0 16 slots. Now, when using dual mode, they're 8x8. You also get a single PCI Express 2.0 slot that runs at time 16. And you also have three PCIe Express 2.0 times one slots. As far as memory goes, this board supports four DIMMs with a maximum of 32 gigabytes, GDDR3, all the way up to 1866 megahertz natively. The Sabertooth has multi-GPU support. Not only does it support NVIDIA and AMD in both their Crossfire and SLI modes, it also uses mixed technology through the virtual MVP technology supplied by the Lucid chip. As far as storage goes, you get four six gigabit connections. These are the two brown ones and the two gray ones. You also get four SATA three gigabit connections that are black. And then finally, you get two eSATA six gigabit connections, which are red. As far as the audio goes, the solution on here is the Realtek ALC882 eight channel high definition audio codec. The LAN is brought to you by the Intel 82579V gigabyte LAN controller. As far as USB support, the board supports two USB 3.0 ports located midpoint on the board. These are for the front panel. You get four USB 3.0 ports on the rear I.O. These are located in blue. You also get 10 USB 2 ports. Six ports are located at midboard and four ports are at the back panel. So that's it, folks. This is the new Sabertooth Z77 motherboard. This is just being the unboxing. See you guys for the full review very, very soon.